Hello my lovely Sigita here and uh, I have I have some numbers for you. I actually have to put number two. Right, I have finished my 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 uh, kits for journals I was making. They are done. I have finished them uh, yesterday already, but it was too late and too dark to uh, film me. That's why I left it for today. So, I uh, yeah, I'm making two uh, kits, and uh, I decided to make better, bigger than three, so smaller. So. I'm taking bag number one and everything what I'm showing you I'm putting in bag number one and that that stays there. Uh, 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 sets are completely different. They are not really uh, the same like, you know, similar items. Uh, now, these similar items but, you know, different pictures. <laughs> right. Anyways. Uh, afterwards I found as well papers like uh, like ledger paper from my country these are like new from shop i purchased them and i forgot to coffee dye because i just found them and i thought it would be good these papers to include as well because you know i think they are different from yours and uh so i will be counting i think just for one set not to just because in another set, exactly the same amount of uh, papers. Two, three, four, five, six. Six of these. So that goes into the bag. So this is number one, okay? And then uh, these as well is like little, uh, little receipts for goods or something you you writing down. One is white and one is pink. Why is that? Because when you write on a white, it goes through on a pink, like copy. But um, when I coffee stained, I think it didn't, didn't work like that. And I like pink. That's why I am including uh, these as well. Two. Eight. Eight of these. So you can then decide you want to coffee stain or not, you know, yourself. Then a little bit of paper. So, um, German and Latvian dictionary papers. I think they are 10. Yeah, that's 10. And Russian book pages as well. They are a coffee stain as well, and they are ten as well. And then I found, you know, I stained um, dictionary pages, but they, you know, went. I when I was tearing out or or cutting out or it just, you know, didn't tear out uh, completely fine and straight. And I thought I still can use it, so that's why I uh, put some stencils on them, because I think you can use it. You can tear it off if you like, or you can add to a glue down to a page, or make a, a, a joint together with paper or fabric, and make, a, you know, join in as a single page. So, these are two, so... I made put them too, and then I may put this uh, like couple romantic one. I like it, uh, so I included that one as well. And then I put two of these stencils, and the same stencil I put on small lined paper, so you can use them as well. So it's quite a bunch of papers. Right, and then let's go to embellishments. Right, you are having three strips of uh, embellished that um, uh, masking tape strip. Okay, you have this one, this is set one. Lengthwise, uh, this is 12 around four, 16, 
around 16 inches and small one is around 10. Um, I, I, I don't know, maybe I will have to bend them. Uh, I'm not sure about that, but at the moment I will put in like that. Right, then we are having, as I put this one in, I was showing you, a uh, little like collage I made on a very grungy one, I made on um, recycled paper, handmade recycled paper, and I like how it uh, uh, teared out, it's a little bit like wonky wonky, it's not completely straight, and uh, I think think it even works more like a, for wall hanging or a journal a cover that's just my idea you know I made it for you to to use whatever you want it, whatever you feel to to use it um, all these are where I'm using a little bit of uh, soft pastels I sprayed with a hairspray to fix it so this is sprayed as well then you are having like that and then when you put it down with a glue it will be straight but now it's like a little bit bending so sorry about that because you know Anna was heat drying as well and that's a reason why it just a little bit bends. Um, this is an old um, file folder paper is a little bit thick it's not uh, it would be like craft paper maybe so you have that as well and then you have this one I think this one you already have seen I put it on a, fa on a Facebook in a group this is on craft paper so you can glue it down or make pockets or use whatever you like then little girl like that on a craft paper as well yeah and I put in this girl too I like it so these are printed on a photo paper uh, then you have this one smaller one like that on a ordinary like paper then you have on a pink paper, this is pink avocado dyed, not mine, a uh, little birdie, little collage. Then you have two envelopes, two envelopes, uh, I put in this one and I made another one like that. As well I'm using like soft pastels and and all the thingies and oil pastels and fabrics and butterflies and stamping so that goes in and then we are having these tags so I put in this pink they, I am using a lot of soft pastels so I, I sprayed and here I actually thought oh shall I put some bling on how that all works together with bling and you know I like it a little bit put um, oil pastel I smeared a little bit over that bling uh, flower not to be like over bling and I think that's really cool it just calmed it down a little bit so and then you have this one with a butterfly and this one with a mushroom and this small, smaller one with it's not like really small. This is five by two and a half. These are quite wide. This is five by almost three and a half. So it's wider. Right. And then we have a small little pocket pocket small little bag with flowers 
So, and here we go. This is a surprise, guys. Remember who, who knows me for longer? I used to do these crochet flowers. So I did them as well. I like, I missed them. And I found a little bit of this uh, pink cotton fabric. I, it goes from light uh, pink to dark pink, to darker one. So I decided to crochet for you. So I put five. I left strings on because maybe you want to just tie on something. Or, you know, it's up to you. You can you afterwards cut it off if you want to. You don't have to even use for journals. Maybe you want for something else. Then there is like quite a lot of, I think 30 or something, these flowers on Russian book page, painted yellow, painted like orangey, and then I put in a pink dots and orange dots, and here is no dots. And as well, these uh, scallop little edges, pink and yellow. So this all is in one set. So this is set number one. Right, I will put in and then not to make it zoom off. Right, just one. Set number two. Set number two has the same papers, right? You have like the I think was six of them, and or then you have these like I think was eight, and then you have ten coffee stained Russian book pages, and then you have uh, a dictionary pages as well coffee stained. These with um, stencil free as well. One with a couple and two with a dandelion. Is it right? Right, these are papers for two. Right, then let's go to embellishments. Here we are having this lady with our, I think it's daughter. So that, with that birdie peeking out, this is going to be in set two. With a little bit of stamping and pinks and buttons and a uh, little bit of cross-stitching. X-stitching. That's not cross-stitching. This is <laughs> X's. Right. Then we are having that little girl on uh, ordinary... I think oh, that was my... Uh, Cut or like from my digital some piece of paper and yeah and this as well and then we have that little boy these girls on a green this is nice velvet uh, strip so I actually like this quite little uh, forestry then we have that on a uh, uh, design paper these ladies yeah, then we have this on that uh, dark green uh, file folder paper. Some cross stitching and and laces and oil pastels. Envelopes. This one with orange and this one I put in. Then strips are free as well. So that strip and that one. So you can or cut it or whatever way you want to use them. Like that. And then we go to tags. Tag like that with a birdie. With a moment. I like that. Very simple. But what I did, I when I was tearing this um uh, little strip off uh, for uh, the tag came a lot of these threads off and I didn't want to chuck it away because they were quite nice color so I stapled them on and really nice I like it and then we have that little boy with fabrics and 
and little bit of pastels. Here is not black pastels. Black pastels are coming here on this one. Yeah, someone was asking on Facebook, is uh, wax uh, uh, like clean for writing? Yeah, it's like that. You know us, just you know, embellished is just front. A little birdie. These are on, and tags all are like um, on a on a design paper, which is like craft paper thickness, or on drawing paper, which is almost like a craft paper thickness. I don't know the thicknesses really. There was nothing on a cover, but that's why. And this one, right? And then little bag as well with. Little flowers in. I even cut it out for you guys. <laughs> so these little flowers, quite a bit. I, th I think it was 30 and 30, but I, 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 you know, I don't want to, you know. And then these color pages as well, different thicknesses as you can see. These are painted, or painted in, with a watercolor uh, paint. And then I'm using uh, to circle all the pastels. And as well, these lovely five pink flowers. Yes, this is what I made. I really, really enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, if you have any questions, please ask. I will put this on. In. And these are going to be... Okay, my lovelies, uh, I am selling them, but uh, I don't know where. I think if I'm go if I'm going to sell it, uh, I'm going to put them on my website, not on Etsy. But uh, as they are reserved, uh, I don't know will they get to, to my shop. So yeah, you just follow my my uh my notification on a youtube i will put it up is it for sale or already sold sorry about that guys okay my lovelies i uh, have a great great day new week everything is fine it's, it's cold it's, it's snowy here again but it's very sunny and it's like really nice outside anyway that's all for today uh, thank you so so much and see you very soon. I am thinking about new digitals and I'm thinking about oh next one I'm going to do yeah maybe today maybe tomorrow already I'm showing you I am making uh the same similar journal I was making with um, shipping tape but uh, I think I will make kind of blank so you can put in whatever you want to put. Okay, that's all for today or for now. And I'll see you very soon. Bye!